Hi guys, it's Crystal from Keto Carnivores Chris, and today I'm going to show you how I hive cut my hot dogs just for something different. I had just the regular Kirkland all beef hot dogs and then started. I had two smaller cutting boards. They are about a quarter inch thick. I wedged my hot dog in between the boards and then made slices down the one side of the hot dog all the way to the cutting boards. I went all the way down the hot dog and then I flipped the hot dog over and did the same thing down the next side of the hot dog. Because I was taping this, my boards were wobbling a little bit and if I were not doing a video, I probably would have wedged my cutting board up against the side of my counter or stove top. Um, but it worked and I was stay, still able to do it. And then you can see here, I've got slices down both sides of the hot dog. I put it off to the side and continued with the rest of the hot dogs. By the end, I was getting quite swift at doing it, as you can see here. Once they were all sliced up, I brought them over to my air fryer and put them on my wire rack. I tried to stretch them out as best as I could. I wasn't really sure what to expect. Um, I almost stretched one a little bit too hard. As you can see here, it kind of broke. So I kind of just twisted it back and placed it there like I hadn't done anything and pretended I didn't do that. I then closed the lid to my air fryer and I did 10 minutes at 390 degrees Fahrenheit. I did check the hot dogs while they were cooking just to make sure I wasn't overcooking them, but 10 minutes was perfect. And you can see here, they kind of stretched out a lot more and you could see a lot more of that hive cut look. Um, I was quite impressed that they stretched out this much and expanded. This was just a fun way to do hot dogs. It was a nice change and my kids loved it. I then plated them all. You can kind of see a little bit better that they all kind of vary in um, shape and size, but they were really good. Like I said, it was just a fun change and the kids really enjoyed them. I'll definitely be making them like this again especially because we don't do buns with the hot dogs. I added some mustard for dipping and it was perfect. I hope you guys enjoy this quick tutorial on how to hive cut your hot dogs. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.